I take care of newborns all the time. And if you have a newborn, you've probably programmed your doctor's number on your speed dial. But how do you know when to push that speed dial button? Surprisingly, some of the worrisome habits of newborns are really just normal parts of development. For example, most newborn babies have a very soft or even liquid bowel movement, which is typical and usually not a cause for concern. Similarly, a newborn spit up may contain trace amounts of blood during the early weeks. If you're breastfeeding, this blood is very likely due to your cracked nipples adjusting to nursing. Occasionally, your baby may also spit up forcefully enough to tear a tiny blood vessel at the base of their esophagus. This sounds scarier than it is, and it usually heals quickly on its own. Mild nasal congestion is also pretty normal. Still, some health symptoms in newborns are cause for concern and require you to use that speed dial. Watch out for a rectal temperature greater than 100.4 degrees Fahrenheit, which can indicate an infection. If your baby is wetting fewer than five diapers in a day or is not shedding tears when she cries, she may be dehydrated and need medical attention. Yellow skin or eyes are signs of jaundice and require a call to the doctor. Bloody stool, greenish mucus and spit up, and an infected looking umbilical stump or circumcised penis also warrants a checkup. Other indications of doctor worthy problems actually may be less obvious, such as changes in your baby's temperament or the character of the cry. A once active baby who is suddenly lethargic or loses interest in feeding may very well be sick. And if your baby is crying in a way that is unfamiliar to you or if she refuses to be comforted, a call to your doctor is warranted. Remember that you are the ultimate expert on your baby. If something feels off, then it very likely is off. So check in with the doctor. I'm medical editor Dr. Corey Bear with your Weekend House Call.